Guys, we got, we got a package for you. I know this one is for you. You want to open it? That's mine. No, this is mine. What? Oh my god, Eddie Oak. It's a my, my one. No, need it's a hat with a bow on it. I got it. And it's a bit sun. Can you Francis? Do every, do every, anyone take a sparkle? Yeah, <laughs> good job. Do anyone who take a sparkle? Oh. Yeah, good job, guys. Thank you, Francis. Thank you, Francis. Thanks. Good job. Yeah. yeah. She was going to get her hair cut. So when you when you see she she's going to have all her hair nice and short. And um, are we going to get Shiog's hair cut now? Well, I'm going to drop you to school, and then I'm going to drop her off at the. Doggy groomers. And there's also dummy doggy groomers. There is. Good morning and welcome to the Caron Family Diaries. Um, we got a package this morning. The kitties opened it up. Um, it was from Frances from Happiness Sparkles. I'm going to link her YouTube channel below. She started making these beautiful hats. Um, and I'm going to link her Instagram uh, Instagram link. I'm going to leave her Instagram link below as well. You have to check it out. Um, even if you're not interested in buying a hat, you have to see the beautiful photos of her grandbaby Nora wearing these beautiful hats. Like, she's only a few weeks old. She's gorgeous. Um, yeah, and she's just got the most beautiful... Um, photos of her on her Instagram um, and do check out Frances's channel as well like she is just she does like beauty reviews um, and product reviews and different all, all sorts of stuff and vlogs and um, and like so if you're into like beauty reviews and things like that definitely check out her channel but like even if you're not like I don't like review like beauty reviews and product reviews like makeup stuff and that it's not what I go on to YouTube to look for but honestly Francis has the most sparkly loving happy bright personality and she's so genuine that like I personally could listen to her talk about anything <laughs> like she's just really I, I know I love her channel um, and I love her and thank you so much Francis for the hats the kids loved them um, yeah, so that's what we did this morning. Um, I dropped the kids off. Shiog is going to the groomers, so she's going to look very different when you see her next. Are you excited, Shiog? Are you thirsty or are you nervous? Also, today's video was supposed to be like my weight loss journey update. Um, but what I what I had planned to do for this video was like a week like video everything all the exercise i was doing during the week okay i'm back at the house now so i kind of feel like although now i can't do much physically to exercise because my back is out um i can still eat healthily and cut down um on the junk food and like with me I kind of always had this mentality like it had to be all or nothing. I either had to be like exercising, doing work, like big workouts every day and walks and eating super uber healthily and otherwise there's no problem. Like, you know, if, if I had a takeaway then that was it. Oh, it's all down the drain. I'm actually feeling pretty positive about it, although it's not going as I planned or expected and often when I start like these exercise regimes or you know you'd be doing so well and you feel so good and then like 
something will happen like this like someone will get sick or someone will, and I'll hurt myself or something will happen that it just throws everything off balance and yeah it's a bit of a wobble but I'm not letting it throw me off balance um I want to know what your best tip is for staying on track when things when things like when an obstacle comes in your way because let's face it that's what like that's what happens that's what throws us off track <laughs> let's try and stay on course I'm getting my back cracked at 11 o'clock so I'm gonna try and get a wash on I'm just gonna do things gently and slowly and not push myself <laughs> Let me see ya. Let me see ya. Let me see ya. <laughs> she oak. She oak. Look at the little bandana. She oak. Let me see ya. Let me see ya. I am just back. My hair is all over the place. Um, I'm just back from the osteo. It went well. Um, and it, not as many cracks as I thought, but there was one crack in my hip that was like, I feel like instantly better. Um, I'm just gonna give Gio a treat. <laughs> and then I went to collect Gio because she looks so cute. The kids aren't gonna recognize her. I'll try and catch that on film. Let me see ya. Let me see ya. Sit here. Sit. 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 Good girl. There you go. I've just collected the kids from nursery and I've put Gio in the pairing so I'm gonna, I'm gonna get her out now and then see the reaction. <laughs> Doesn't she look lovely? Yeah, yeah you can rubber, of course you can. Yeah.